Afternoon folks, Mick here from Surface Eating Systems in uh, a snowy, sleety, freezing Scotland at the moment. And what I'm going to show you today, if you want to take a look, is our solution to uh, stopping snow and ice from forming on the front of your satellite dish. This is a direct TV dish. Um, now this particular model uh, comes with an integral heating system inside it. Um, normally, we can do these in two two ways. We can have the uh, the cover, which basically bolts, or sorry, just attaches to the rim of the dish via via these clips, which go all the way around and secure everything in place. See, one there, one there, right round. So it's actually quite sturdy once it's on. Uh, it's made of a UV stable uh, RF uh, invisible plastic so it won't affect your TV signal uh, with regards to the heating elements what we have is a small heating element which goes inside these channels and they go backwards and forwards and connect to a small temperature sensor which is actually situated on the inside of this dish so when the temperature falls to three degrees, um, it will turn the system on and it'll keep it on until that senses the temperature, whether it be the ambient temperature going up or whether it's the enclosed heated air, which is trapped inside the antenna and the skin, goes above seven degrees. Now this is a 110 volt system, but we can also do these in 230 volts as well or even lower voltage should they need be right let's have a look at the uh, thermal imager and see what you see there you go so let's go on the van first and the van is showing let me see oh it's probably heating up in there let's go to the base the base is showing about minus one and a half two degrees uh, and that's purely because of the wind chill factor at the moment it's it's just starting to snow again, or sleety snow, but the wind is quite cold. So anyway, and the dish itself at the moment is running at approximately, so let's get on the top bit, 12 degrees. So that's more than enough to stop any snow or ice from forming on the dish. Now the principle behind this is what will happen is the heating elements will heat the front of the dish, but the air inside will also warm and rise to the top of this cowling bit at the top, which, well, there's a the heating element, this is at 19. Yeah, which will actually melt any snow on the top. So it will actually reduce any uh, weight loading uh, if you live in a, an area where you get substantial snow. But for normal areas, it's sometimes just uh, good enough to use the actual front cover without actually having any heating elements in and we do have uh, a slightly different model which basically enables uh, you just to clip on a system without the heating it doesn't have the channels it's a more curved surface as you can see that one there has got a step out and we need that for the cable gland at the bottom but the un unheated version it just basically follows the shape of the antenna down Right, so let's have a quick walk around and see what we can see. As you can see, oh, that cable there was just purely a, an addition on for an exhibition where we had them illuminated. Uh, looks quite good actually at night, but anyway, so all the clips around the side just hold the dish cover in place. We've got a cover on the front and the, basically the cable is actually running through to my van and it's going in a 110 volt power supply which is being fed via the van so if you're ever in need of covers or de-icing for your satellite dishes whether they be commercial or domestic don't forget to give us a call. 
you can contact us via our website which is www.shs-ltd.com or you can telephone us at this is UK number which is uh, 01592 uh, if you're calling from outside the UK obviously put the plus four four in front of that without the zero obviously and this is what we do for a living been doing it now for over 20 years so we're getting quite good at it believe it or not anyway that's part three by the way look for part one and part two for the other types of antennas that we do